All right. My passion is helping patients live their best, most healthiest life. So that doesn't just mean finding an illness and treating that illness or finding you know, a problem and trying to fix that problem. It's actually going beyond that and trying to find out and dig deeper and what is gonna make you the healthiest person that you can be. I'm also passionate about working with patients as a partner. So I want you to have just as much input as I do in your health because you know best what's going on in your body, you're your best advocate. So I really like to work with people versus just telling you what to do and hoping you do it. I find that when people are more invested in their health care and they care more, they're just gonna stick with things better and not, you know, just because that person said to do it, I'm gonna do that. They really want to get better and they wanna feel good. So I'm really passionate about helping patients really just be super involved with their health care. Right. Right. Yeah. Enough. No, that that's perfect. perfect. That that you're doing perfect. really, really well. Yes. All right. So, what is low T? Okay. <laughs> Can't do my intro. No, yes, oh, absolutely. Yes, you got I it. I know it's hard. hard. I just, yeah. okay. They're just but, pointers. Yep, yep. Yes. You got it. All right. So, should I so keep start with okay. what is low T? Okay. You don't have to introduce yourself anymore. Okay. Yep. Yeah. All right. So I just wanted to give some information about low T or low testosterone. Um, so there's I'm going to stop of, you real quick. Oh, sure. um, you can reference this. Try to look right into the lens yeah. as much okay. as possible because right. it looks like you're looking. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Gotcha. So this, is, uh, this will be your reference. I'm getting as close as I can. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Sounds good. Okay. So I want to talk a little bit about low T or low testosterone. Some of the symptoms that guys experience with low testosterone levels are fatigue, just feeling kind of apathetic. Um, some guys have a low libido with low testosterone and potentially some issues with erectile dysfunction. Some guys also notice their muscle mass starts to decrease uh, or maybe they're not as flexible as they used to be. Um, they kind of feel burned out and maybe their mental agility just isn't what it used to be or they just don't feel like themselves uh, anymore. Low testosterone can actually lead to some health concerns. So it could potentially lead to insulin resistance and that can actually contribute further to low testosterone. So it's kind of a vicious cycle with that. Um, so the testosterone, if it's at a good level, can actually improve your glucose control. So it's actually a lot better than any pharmaceutical out there for um, glucose control. Um, the other thing that um, low testosterone can lead to are cardiovascular issues like hypertension, cholesterol issues, other cardiovascular diseases. Um, and sometimes these guys that have low testosterone can get higher estrogen levels. Um, there's something called aromatization that occurs where testosterone can actually convert to estrogen. And so sometimes we see these guys with what we would call uh, man boobs and it's very tricky to bring those estrogen levels down um, and get rid of that that issue if that's occurring. Um, the other thing that it can affect is your other hormones. So it can affect your um, thyroid, other neurotransmitter levels, um, and it also can potentially cause an issue with enlarged prostate. Perfect. Good, good, good. Good, I got everything. Good. You, you were perfect. <laughs> you're getting great. It was actually getting to a point where it was starting Too to much. sound a little long. Okay. okay. Mm -hmm. So I think that's perfect. Like okay. what you have on a card like that is more than enough. And even if you don't cover all of it's it, fine. you're fine. Okay. Because that was starting to get a little bit long, I think. Okay. Yep. But yep. it was perfect. Long did I have to do it over? No. Okay, good. No, no, no. no, I don't think you need to do it over. No. But